Let's just say that middles are gonna run an A or a B, which to me is a one or a three, okay? Your terminology, right? 51 and 31, okay? You're still running four, okay? And so we're gonna have to defend that, okay? Now, this is where people are different. What are you gonna do with the middle? What are you gonna do? I'm sorry, what's your first name? Kelsey. Kelsey. What if Kelsey runs the three? What is she going to do? Is she gonna hold and dive to try to stop the three? Thinking we've got a right side player. Right now, you definitely would get over here without a right side player, right? But let's say there's a right side player. What is she gonna do? What would you have her do? Let's say I've got an average right side player. Are you gonna have her stay right in the middle? Knowing she's not even a middle? That'd be a hard move to make, right? Okay, so let's say we're gonna have her get right hand on ball. So if they set the B and she comes in here for the B, where are you gonna be? Right hand on ball, get over here. Okay, right hand on ball, okay? And then you're gonna to try to help, which means we'll probably screw you up out here, maybe, okay? And then we got the four ball. So th this is when it gets complicated. This is why you gotta do this stuff all the time, which is why you hope you don't play somebody at your level that's got a great middle hitting, hitting 31s and a great four ball and then somebody back here because you're going to be probably in trouble if that happens. All right, here we go. Luckily, we got a great setter, okay? Okay, all right. Now, this is when your backcourt defense has to really get good because you're stressing out your block. And the other thing we have to understand is that the offense is going to look really good right now because coach is putting the ball around right top of the setter's head. The idea with your serve and your offense is not to allow the ball to come right on top of your setter's head where they can do, where he can do whatever he wants to do. But occasionally, probably maybe 40% of the time, that's going to happen. All right, here we go. Watch the B. Watch the B. All right. Now, even then, we had the middle, right hand on ball. We had Hatch from Arizona trying to dive in and help out. And Kelsey, I was going to say Kelsey, finds the seam with great vision, hits it where every middle hits the B set or the three set most of the time in that slot. We call it the, the B slot. You would call it the three slot because that's what you call it, right? So somebody better get over there. That would be you again. Okay. All right. Here we go again. So we're figuring out how to stop this. Okay, all right, run it down, there you go. Nice play, nice play, okay?